by four and moving away. In the gate. And are off. Take me home, off to a good getaway. Hetty G is there. Mary Alice with speed in between horses and Tappa Claire just in behind the top flight. Yesterday's plan will settle on the outside and trailing the field is Sexy Yama. It is Take Me Home and Mary Alice head to head for the lead and Hetty G parked on the outside of them for that opening for a long and a half and Tappa Claire racing fourth while saving ground. Yesterday's plan travels in fifth position and five from a speed and Sexy Yama on the inside. Tight pack only six lengths will cover them five and a half for a Longs out. Take me home at a solid pace, pushed along by Mary Alice in second, and Hetty G continues in third. Tap at a clear on the inside, saving ground. Yesterday's plan in good striking range there, only four and a half for the pace, and Sexy Emma is sixth and last into the far turn run, where it's Take Me Home still from Mary Alice by a neck, and Hetty G on the outside, remaining in third position. Tap at a clear is in fourth. Yesterday's plan right there, the outside, just five from the front, and last is Sexy Emma. They race to the top of the stretch now. Take me home, still the one to catch on the rail. Take me home, turns in and tries to kick. Take me home now, about a two-length lead. On Hetty G, out in the center is yesterday's plan in third. Then it's Sexy Yama trying to angle between horses, coming to the last furlong and a half. Take me home, and here's yesterday's plan leveling up on the outside to take the lead. Here's yesterday's plan in front, and Sexy Yama running stoutly on the inside, now just about to claim second with a sixteenth of a mile left to go. It's yesterday's plan, Sexy Yama take me home yesterday's plan and Sheldon Russell in the Sunday opener from Sexy Yama second and take me home third. Minute 37. And they're off. There's Boss Life, early speed. And Maximo Strong Bean Pole on the outside. Lifespan is right there, up close to and tempting moments moving up on the inside. It is Maximo Strong leading the way early. On the inside, tempting moment just up to second and Boss Life alongside of that one. Then Bean Pole, Lifespan travels fifth. And next is two doors down the two path. And Power Boss is saving ground. Another three lengths back. And yes means no. And Favor Maker is in the back, some 11 to 12 to close in. Maximo Strong bounding along with a two-length lead at a good clip. Maximo Strong from Boss Life in second and Tempting Moment is in third. Lifespan is fourth. Two doors down is in fifth position and Favor Maker out there. Pay wide and far outside is yes means no. Power Boss drops to the back of the pack and Bean Pole trailing the field. Maximo Strong challenged by Boss Life. A neck behind around the far turn and Lifespan is getting closer. Three wide of the track. Two doors down just in behind them in fourth and Favor Maker is in fifth. Yes means 
means no six, and Power Boss, and followed by Tempting Moment and Beanpole. Top of the stretch, Lifespan on the outside. Now to challenge Maximo Strong, Boss Life. Boss Life on the outside, Lifespan. Maximo Strong down to the inside. They're joined by two doors down. Out of the middle of the track now is trying to come with a run. Two doors down, way out in the middle of the track, but Lifespan has come away with the lead. Lifespan in front about a half length from two doors down. Two doors down outside, just in front. Lifespan's got a kick back on the inside with a 16 to go. Two doors down, Lifespan down to the two. It's two doors down, Lifespan. Two doors down, Lifespan. Two doors down, Lifespan. Two doors down to Lifespan in the photo in race two. Photo finish. Minute 39. In race three. And they're off. Buddy Sunset Keeper in spite flashing up there, and Thomas the Gray also with speed. A bourbon Gal on the outside and had the notion down of the rail. They're followed by Ranchar, who's already about five off. A speed, worst, best idea ever. And B Bop Malola in the back of the pack on the inside. It's Bodie Sunset leading the way from Thomas second, and Keeper in spite inside in third position, and Bourbon Gal outside of the clear from fourth as they round that far turn. Back there is Ranchar, who's about five to make up it now, and had the notion. Ocean is next as they round the turn. Worst best idea ever. And B. Bapalola trailing the field. Less than three furlongs to go. Bodhi Sunset. Toma there on the outside to challenge for the lead. And there goes Toma. Toma kicks on strongly. Keeper in spite tries to come off the inside from third to position. And then it is Bourbon Gal driven in fourth into the stretch now. And it's Toma the one to catch with a three length advantage. Wall of horses. Here comes B. Bapalola from between horses trying to split for a share and have the notion on the inside getting through. Had the notion in front from Toma. B. Bapalola the far outside. Worst best idea ever. It's had the notion in Kevin Gomez. Had the notion, Bebop Palola was second, and then it was Toma, worst best idea ever, and Ranchar. In the gate, one mile. And they're off. 
Chit Chat Girl was first to fly away from there and Paz the Wine Early Speed along with Pete's Pride up on the inside now and In Class is coming forward too. Pete's Pride and In Class now on the first two and it's Chit Chat Girl back in third to position and Lana is in fourth. Paz the Wine fifth on the inside. Another two back at the field and Calypso Ghost and Wind then Grin and Thunder Turtle is eighth and last. Well removed from the rail is In Class who leads the way out there at about the four maybe five path and Pete's Pride against the rail second another two and Chit Chat Girl is racing third position. Lana is in fourth. Favorite Calypso goes to the inside about seven off of speed. And then it is Win then Grin. And Thunder Turtle racing back in the pack with Paz the one on the inside. Into the far turn run. In class leads the way. In class in front still now. Opening up a five length advantage on Pete's Pride in second. Calypso Ghost beginning to get interested from third position as they have about three and a half furlongs left to go. Another four in this Chit Chat Girl is dropped back then win then grin and thunder turtle and lana and paz the wine top of the stretch where it's in class the one to reel in but here's calypso ghost sneaking through the inside with a quarter of a mile left to go calypso ghost now powers away opening up on in class by four or five lengths pete's pride is in third open scramble for the next spots win then grin and then thunder turtle one furlong left to go and it's calypso ghost by six from in class in second here's thunder turtle running on the outside Thunder Turtle running strongly now. Thunder Turtle, Thunder Turtle coming at Calypso Ghost, who's desperate. Calypso Ghost, Thunder Turtle's coming on the outside. Thunder Turtle, Calypso Ghost, Thunder Turtle. In the photo finish, Pete's Pride in another photo for third. And we're off. Rip it. Stumble there at the start. The Wolfman out early with escapability. All three is a favorite on the outside. Stoking up early speed and ferocious storm on the chase. Has dropped back fourth. And rapid response to the inside in fifth. And smitten enough about three deep. And just pick one is six to make up now as they pass a half mile pole and rip it trailing the field. Into the far turn. Escapability is the leader from all threes. And the Wolfman on the inside. The Wolfman's coming back for a little more on the inside on the chase there of escapability. Escapability from the Wolfman and all threes to the outside of the forward rapid response is next and ferocious storm just pick one inside there and smitten enough and trailing the fielders rip it they're at the top of the stretch now escape ability against the rail leading the way the wolfman on the outside coming gamely after that one now they head to head for the lead to the final furlong here is the wolfman on the outside to grab the lead from escape ability in the final furlong and rapid response is third with a 16th left to go it's the wolfman the wolfman opens up three the Wolfman, solid winner by four at the finish from Escapability. Then rapid response and just pick one and Ferocious Storm. The Wolf.
and they're off. Rapid Ash Queen asks for early zip. Scarlet Tanager there too. And Thea's theme and introspection away on the inside fourth. Ada Bell travels in fifth position in advance of Malison in trading sense. And I Am a Dancer is trailing now about 13 off the pace up ahead. Rapid Ash Queen, Scarlet Tanager mixing it up head to head. It's three back and Thea's theme tracking speed and introspection is fourth. And then on the outside is Ada Bell. Another five to trading sense and Malison and trailing the field still I am a dancer. Scarlet Tanager gets away. Length and a half with a half mile left to go from Rapid Ash Queen. Now two. On the outside is uh, Thea's uh, theme is racing their third position. And introspection slipping through down to the inside. Introspection now just taking that second spot. Ada Bell still has seven to come now. And Trading Sense is dropping to the back of the pack. They're at the top of the stretch above a quarter of a mile left to go. Scarlet Tanager turns in about two length lead from introspection and Thea's theme. And Ada of Bell is pushed to fourth, turning for home into the stretch at the 316s and straightening away. And later is now introspection. Leader introspection, a furlong out. Introspection running willingly down to the Laurel line, opening up three. Ada Bell on the inside. Thea's theme on the outside. And the battle left for second with a 16th to go. Introspection and Julian Pimentel. El Coast to win by three from Thea's theme. And then inside Ada Bell, Melisson, and Scarlett Tanager. And they're off. A worry sky set along for the lead. It got Grandma with that natural leg too. Cheyenne Bull is right there in third of the outside. Empty nestered out of the rail, racing in fourth into the turn run. So around the turn they go, and it got Grandma leads the way from a worry sky by two and a half. Empty nester down inside there in Cheyenne Bull. The outside has approved this message. Day is in between horses. Campari now settled to the back of the pack with Posterity racing out there three deep. And Moonlight Shadow is last in between horses back there to the tail of the field now nine from the pace up ahead it got grandma approved this message first to make up over the outside and cheyenne bull third awari sky fourth length and a half and it's day traveling in fifth here's moonlight shadow trying to get underway still in between horses posterity alongside of that one an empty nester at the rail and trailing the field is campari 15 to 16 off the pace up ahead it got grandma's been going a solid pace and approved this message putting heat on to the outside it's a gap of six lengths to a worry sky and Cheyenne Bull fourth. Here's Moonlight Shadow still at an even pace, racing in fifth into the far turn run, three A's to go. It got Grandma from Approve This Message with a worry sky third. A gap of four and Cheyenne Bull inside is a favorite Moonlight Shadow still eight to the front. Then Empty Nester trying to come out there three wide. A quarter of a mile left to go and it's It Got Grandma leading the way from Approve This Message fully driven. A worry sky getting a great journey just off the inside now comes a worry sky. Out in the middle of the track is Empty Nester. Empty Nester is coming on the uh, side. Empty Nester on the outside with It's Got Grandma and a Worry Sky third. Empty Nester rolling on the outside with Weston Hamilton. It Got Grandma Carol Cedeno. It's Empty Nester to get up. From It Got Grandma and a Worry Sky. Moonlight Shadow, then Cheyenne Bull.
They are in. And they're off. Redeem Eddie. First away from the gate. Whiskey and you on the outside. Here's Girls Love Me in a hurry, too. Girls Love Me on the inside now. And Redeem Eddie, their head head for the lead. The poser gets good position early in the race. And in between horses is Rail Master. Oxide is alongside of that one. And then it's Martin saving ground. Whiskey and you. Drops about six to seven from the pace. Youngest of five is in between. Then Tommy Shelby and seven on the rocks. And back of the pack is Sir Buck in Black. Heading on for the far turn. About 13 lengths will cover them. Girls love me and the poser with a quick move through on the inside. Now the poser is eager and going on into the far turn. Rail Master racing in third, then Redeem Eddie in fourth position, length and a half more. Youngest of five, Martins on the inside, then Oxide, three wide, Whiskey and you. Back of the pack, we have Tommy Shelby next, and Sir Back in black, and seven on the rocks trailing the field. Top of the stretch, and it's Girls Love Me from the poser now. Errols Love Me trying to go on from the poser, still on the inside there and redeem Eddie in between horses, punching on through, then youngest of five into action. The outside two is Oxide into the final furlong, and it's redeem Eddie just a narrow lead from a game the poser on the inside. Here's Oxide out in the center of the track trying to pick up on the final 16th. Oxide on the outside, redeem Eddie, redeem Eddie. Oxide's coming, redeem Eddie, Oxide. Oxide, redeem Eddie, and the poser followed by youngest of five, and girls love me. And they're off. Pardon the pun up on the inside, flashing up there. And the outside is Drink Mo Bourbon. King Pekai is just in behind them in summer somewhere, two in between horses. Sensationalist race along along in fifth. And Royal Ian is next in sixth and hinting. Drops over the inside now, some seven lengths off the pace up ahead, another five lengths back. And it's Naked in Cabo and Rooftop Bar. They're in the back now. And about 13 lengths off a good pace going by Pardon the Pun, pushed hard of the outside by Drink Mo Bourbon in second. King Pekai getting an inside trip in third. Sensationalist is fourth. Royal Ian Summer somewhere. Light blue colors in between horses. They're followed by Hinting. Hinting's trying to move up now within a half dozen of the pace. Rooftop bar back of the pack still with Naked in Cabo trailing the field. Pardon the pun into the far turn with a two-length lead now on Drink More Bourbon second. Sensationalists and King Piquet Summer somewhere. Hinting's on the inside slipping through just inside of King Piquet who begins to tire a little bit. And in the outside is Royal Ian under pressure too. Rooftop bar now begins to move and Rooftop Bar getting an inside run. 11 from that pacemaker who is still, pardon the pun, turning for home. Pardon the pun, the one to catch from second now on the outside. Sensationalist. Rooftop Bar out in the center of the track continues to gain a bit of momentum, but time is running out. Three sixteenths of a go, and it is, pardon the pun, in front three. Sensationalist is driving hard. Rooftop Bar is third with a furlong left to go. Pardon the pun, two and a half in front. Sensationalist trying to bear down on the outside of the big prize. 
twice. Sensationalist on the outside coming at pardon the pun. Sensationalist, pardon the pun. Sensationalist, a sensational day for Weston Hamilton. Three wins. It's close second. Pardon the pun was there. Rooftop bar outside.